This electronics information practice test question for the ASVAB and PiCat says, if R1 equals 100 ohms and R2 also equals 100 ohms, what is the total resistance in the circuit? So by looking at this circuit, you should be able to say that these two resistors, R1 and R2, are in parallel with each other. Therefore, the total resistance in the circuit, R of T, is going to be equal to 1 over 1 over R1 plus 1 over R2. And we know R1 is 100 ohms, and R2, likewise, is 100 ohms. So let's plug those values in and solve accordingly. This becomes 1 over 1 over 100. Again, R1 is 100, plus 1 over R2 is also 100. All right, in the denominator, we're simply adding 1 over 100 plus 1 over 100. Um, when you add fractions like 1 over 100 plus 1 over 100, you should recognize that the denominators are the same. So this is going to be 2 over 100. All right, so this becomes 1 over 2 over 100. And ultimately, what are we doing here? This says 1 divided by 2 over 100. When you divide fractions, you follow the algorithm keep, change, flip. So we're going to keep this 1 the same. This becomes 1. We're going to change to uh, multiplication, so from division to multiplication, and then we're going to flip this fraction in the denominator. So instead of being 2 over 100, it's going to be 100 over 2. This becomes 100 divided by 2 is 50. 1 times 50 is 50. So in other words, in this parallel circuit, there are there is a total of 50 ohms of resistance.